Hi guys, Dan's Dollars here. We are back with Dan's coin review and valuations and in this video we're going to be looking at the 1879 one penny coin. As always with the review videos we'll start off with the design on the coin, move on to those mintage figures, exactly how many was released for circulation and then we'll finish off with the true value of the coin in perfect condition and also in circulated quality as well. So we'll start off then on the left hand side and one of my favourite Britannia designs the reason for this, we've got the lighthouse to the left of the Britannia and we have got the ship sailing on the right. As we've noticed before, with the pre-decimal half pennies and pennies, those ships do disappear, the lighthouses do come back and it's nice to see both of them on the same coin. Again, in the middle, we have got the seat of Britannia trident in left hand with the shield bearing the union flag in the right. One penny either side of the Britannia, the coin's face value, 1879 the year of issue. On the right hand side now we have got the portrait of Queen Victoria looking left, Victoria in lettering on the left hand side and we've got some more lettering around the top and down the right and this stands for by the grace of God, Queen of all Britons, Defender of the Faith. An absolute stunner again with a stunning Britannia, design completed, let's move on to those mintage figures. So back in 1879, 7,666,000 of this one penny coin was released for circulation. How much is the coin worth? Well, again, a really desirable Britannia design. You will be looking £200 for a perfect condition coin. The problem is, there's probably not many of them out there. A really nice quality coin, £50 to £60, down to a coin that you see on the screen now. You will be looking five to six pounds for this coin. Again, a little bit of a shame with the shield there being worn. If that was in better condition, you will be looking at around a 10 pound coin. Plenty of these will be in super worn condition. I'm sure you can maybe, with your version at home, barely see the Britannia or the portrait of Queen Victoria. You're down to 50p for the coin, maybe even less. So again, definitely worth just keeping hold of it, keeping it for those date runs and seeing if you can own a penny from every single year that it was made. So hopefully you do have a coin in nice condition, you've got a couple of hundred pounds sat there, or maybe even just a nice quality version, 40 to 50 pounds, again, not bad for a one penny coin. Again, if you would like to see your own coin featured in a review video, please do comment it below. There will be plenty of review videos to get you all through the evening, and I'll be back for seven o'clock for the Breakfast Club coin. Stay safe, fun as always, guys. Thanks for watching.